I'm Margie Remers Davis with Crystal Clear Cashflow, creator of the Fast and Easy Way to QuickBooks Online Pro Advisor Certification. Now, if you are in the process of getting your certification, then you may have gotten an email from Intuit that looked a little scary because it announced that they are shutting down the current Pro Advisor Certification program. It's nothing to be scared of. Let me show you what's going on. All right, so there were two emails that went out based on the certification that you were in the process of getting. The first one was about payroll. The second was about the basic and advanced level certifications. The payroll email noted that this, the course is being shut down on October 17th of this year, and the basic and advanced that came out said that it is being shut down on October 31st of this year. Now, this is not something to worry or or panic about because every year Intuit releases a new version of the certification test. They do that so that they can include in the new material all of the bells and whistles and things that have changed. And so you need to decide if you want to hurry and get your certification done by these dates or if you want to just wait until the new material comes out. And so what you might be asking yourself is, should I hurry or should I wait? Now, to help you make this decision, I wish that I could just make, give you a quick answer and just tell you what you should do, but unfortunately I can't. So I'm just gonna help you make this decision by, I have my little whiteboard here, my chalkboard, and we're gonna do some pros and cons of hurrying versus waiting, okay? So the number one reason why you would want to hurry and get it done is so that it's done. So it's not hanging over your head anymore. So you can just get on with your life. You can get your pro advisor listing. You can start getting those leads that automatically come from, uh, from Intuit's marketing and you can just have it done and behind you. So that is the number one reason why you would wanna just do it now. Um, however, the one reason why you might want to wait is so that you have access to the new material. As I mentioned, the whole reason Intuit's doing this is so that they can release new training and new certification for um, all of the new bells and whistles and things that they have incorporated. So if you want to see the new material, then you might want to wait until um, the end of October for payroll or early November for the basic and advanced. Now, if you decide that you want to wait and you would like our help from our fast and easy version of the courses, then there will be a delay. I don't get the courses and the, and the test any sooner than you do. So, so I don't work for Intuit, I just get it when they release it and it will take me some time to build a fast and easy version of the course. Our, um, our release dates for the basic is gonna be December 1st, for advanced, January 1st, and for payroll, I have no idea. I put TBD there to be determined. Um, here's the thing with the payroll is that that last version of the payroll certification was their very first one. And so this second version I anticipate is gonna be much improved, very different. I don't, maybe it is, maybe it isn't, but I have no way of knowing. And so I don't have the experience of re, putting together a course to be able to tell you when that payroll is going to be available. So if you want your certification in payroll, I highly recommend that you get that get it before that deadline of October uh, of October 17th. Of course, if you want our help with any of the certifications, there's no delay. The courses are available right now. We can help you and you can absolutely do it before the deadline. I'll talk about that in a minute. But if you wanna wait, just know there'll be a delay getting the fast and easy version of the training materials. Now, one benefit to uh, hurrying is that um, if you fail any section of the test, you will only have to retake the section that you missed. 
Okay, so um, there's in the basic level test, there are five sections. If you fail one section, then you only have to retake that section. However, if you hurdle both the, the old version and the new version, then you will have to retake the entire test next time. So um, that's just, again, something to think about is that if you hurry now and you retake, you only have to do what you missed. If you are in the middle of it, you do one, and then you wait for the other version, you'll have to take that whole test again. Why? Because it's new material. <laughs> so it's they revamped it. So um, that's just something to keep in mind as you are making this decision. Now, um, one thing that if you decide to hurry and you decide to get your certification right now, you will have to recertify in the spring of 2023. That's not very far away. The reason is because the current version of the test is all of the old stuff. In the spring, they will test you on only the new stuff. So it's a much shorter test. It only covers the new stuff. So you're still gonna learn all of that. You just won't learn it until spring of 2023. If you decide to wait for the new version coming out in November, end of October for payroll, early November for the others, um, then you won't have to recertify until 2024. So you'll have more time. And the reason why is because the new test is going to have the new stuff. So you won't have to uh, test on just that little piece because it will already be in that big test. Okay. Now, if you decide that you want to hurry and get it done before the deadline, you absolutely can do that and we can help. So fast and easy, we are all about creating fast and easy certification courses and our basic level test, you can get that certification in just about four hours. So the at payroll and advance, they do take a little bit longer, six, eight um, hours. But still, you can get your certification in a day. You can get it in a weekend. So if you decide that you want to make the decision to go ahead and hurry and get it done now, you absolutely can. There is time. But uh, if you want to wait, that's absolutely fine too. You just need to know that our fast and easy versions will take a while. And certainly with payroll, I have no idea when the next one is gonna be released. So if you want that payroll certification, I highly recommend that you kind of get a move on and do it uh, before that October 17th deadline. All right, that's it for me. I hope this has been helpful in helping you make your decision about whether you wanna get that certification now or whether you wanna wait until they release the new version. As always, if you have any questions, do let me know. You can comment below or send us an email, support at fastandeasyqbo.com, and we are here to help you along your journey. I can't wait to hear your success story.